Today's episode is a bit of a warm-up session, which is why I've chosen a very simple invention to start with. So today we're going to invent a game uh, based on our robot walker. Okay, so let's get started. So when we go through our goals and limitations, we know a couple of things. We need to invent something that's fun. That's one thing. Um, we need to use this. So we analyze what this is doing and it's it's walking. And if you remember, maybe you've seen our robot walkers before. They walk kind of straight. So uh, we can use that to figure out what kind of games are there in that scope. So I'll go into my brainstorming session and, uh, and figure out uh, what could be a good idea uh, for a game. Okay, we're back here. Uh, I've uh, done some scribbles. This is it's nothing uh, serious, but my, what I remember when I started my ideation was um, the robot walker has a slight curve and it's on the ground. So it reminds me of a bowling ball in a bowling alley. Uh, so I'd like to try to make a robot bowling game. So we have the bowling ball. I will from now on call him Bolly. And uh, we need to invent the pins. So now we can actually go into problem statements. We need the pins to be able to be tipped over by this, uh, the robot or Bolly. Uh, so that's our challenge. Um, and analyzing a bowling pin, we can actually look online. It's a good way of looking at it. Uh, what we can see is that they have a small base. They're pretty tall, so they can tip over. So we need to build something with a small base that's pretty tall especially in scale to the bowling ball uh, and that will fall over. So let's uh, do some design ideation. I do a couple of simple designs. I would like to invite my colleague Eric to help me build so it's a bit faster because collaboration helps us go faster forward. Eric, uh, can you join me? I'm coming! Here's our pinned prototypes. So that's the thing, we, now we go into the prototype stage. Uh, for the pins. So um, our assessment will be, is this possible for the robot to tip over? Uh, other limitations we can have are like, do they look good? Is it appropriate for a bowling alley? So first criteria is, do they tip over easily? So we, uh, I simulate the robot, oh, it tips over pretty quickly. This is actually one of the criteria. This is fast. So if you're in a rush to build your bowling alley game, this would be the option to run with. Today, we want to make it look nicer, so and we're not in quite as much of a rush, so we chose this. That's still efficient and, and pretty fast, with a very small base, and it's taller than the other one. A very important thing is they should be able to topple each other over. Ah, it's good enough. Let's go out and try it. Okay, it's time for the grand finale. First one. Yeah. The so me and uh, Eric, this is Eric uh, Torquist. Yeah. Uh, we're going to compete in the world's first ever robot bowling championship. We're both going to use the bowling ball bolly uh, yeah. and see if he is good at tipping over the pin. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Come on, Wally. Oh no, it's gonna go up in the. Yeah, no. Oh no, it's not gonna. Ah. Very expected result. Oh. Okay, second throw. Yeah. Very satisfied with this. <laughs> oh! So I got zero pins. It's all about the drop. Yeah. Yeah. I'm I'm aiming for the middle of it. Oh, yeah. One. Two. Come on. <laughs> it is slipping. So, 
They're a bit heavy. They are a bit heavy for, for, for Bali. Yeah. Yeah. So we can see here that actually maybe we need to go back and do the lightweight power. Yeah. Without a battery even. Yeah. But you got three points. Thank you. You want? Iteration one, grand finale. It works. Uh, could be lighter though. So it's time for a grand finale two. Yeah. Uh, we, as we showed, the system is fast, so we modified the pins mm -hmm. to the lighter weight systems. We learned something from trying the prototype. Yes. And to be fair, now it's your turn to start. Uh, yeah. And I will document that and then I follow up and we'll see. So yeah. you have three points from the first round. Yes. It's just the line I wanted. Come on. Yes. No, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> Come on. You can, you can uh, get stuck in some dust or something. Uh, okay. Ah. ah. No. I never learned. This is going way off. Second one. No. Okay, so it's a tie. So uh, thank you everyone yes. for uh, for today. But I must say, total win for me. Yeah, in yeah. total, yeah. you have better performance, especially. Thank you. I, I I really had a bad throw, so I need to practice that. Yeah, and I hope you come back for the next episode. Bye. Bye bye.